الرحمن الرحيم Assalamu alaikum and greetings, Ali Shalman. Yes, yes, I know. There are just a whole lot of, I mean, tons of uh, these little four channel six axis gyro, fun to fly and fun to have fun, kind of uh, toy grade RC quadcopters in the market. That actually, it's not fun anymore to have just way too many of these. Now, I think these manufacturers should focus on the fun factor rather than just copying and taking things and building and selling. Fun factor, yes, fun factor, creativity, something that will keep our interest alive in these little little six axis gyro quadcopters or drones they are calling. Sitting right here with me is the block flying the Lego block or the bricks kind of quadcopter. There is a fun factor here. There's a creative factor here because you will build this quadcopter all by yourself and then you will fly it. This is a good idea and thank you very much whoever you are for bringing us this little blocks flying mini DIY quadcopter. Here we have the Blocks Flying Mini DIY Building Blocks Quadcopter Experience DIY Fun. Yes, that is right. You will experience DIY fun with this quadcopter. Anything that you build and fly is much more fun compared to something that just comes out and you fly it. Alright, so let's pull it out. We have a user manual which shows Lego kind of blocks and shows the similar kind of method to for you to read and build your quadcopter awesome very nice and it also has the uh, introduction to your radio control now we have a couple of boxes and a little radio neat radio man check this out it's really cute it's really small it will fit in their hands really perfectly my hands are small so i can fly it i mean using this radio very well i don't feel bad uh well little bit of buttons we will talk about these buttons later according to user manual very very soon anyway the first layer we have a flight controller and a USB dongle to charge the battery please tell me you have a battery inside uh, I don't see battery here and on the second layer we have some blocks to build the body on the third layer yay we have motors and batteries awesome so we have two motors only Oh, no, sorry, uh, there's one more. I was like, why only two motors? So we have uh, arms with the motors, brush motors, spare propellers, uh, propeller, one set of propeller already installed here, and we have a battery here. Yes, I was worried about it. Now, speed selector, this top button is a speed selector. This left button is not doing anything. Now, these are the trimmers for the left and right, that is roll, and these are the trimmers for the pitch. Of course, on off switch. Why intimidate people with so many buttons here? If these two buttons don't do anything, well, maybe it's the uh, you know future expansion for the Kamikaze mode. They're, they're gonna <laughs> probably introduce on the compass-based uh, flight modes. Uh, oh, anyway, so this is a nice and neat little radio. Now, in order to build this quadcopter, I don't want to spoil the fun by building it myself. I want to bring in Arish and Hadi and let my kids build this quadcopter and I'll configure it and we'll fly it and we'll see how well it is. Thank you for watching the video and thank you very much for your continuous
continue to support watch my work on YouTube. Please subscribe to my channel and stay updated for all the regular video uploads. If you like this video, please hit the like button and share the link over your social sites.